What is up beautiful people, Mr. P here back with another video. This is breaking news. Neo beat Tesla in crash test safety. This test was performed by CIASI, China Insurance Automotive Safety Index. So they performed these safety tests not for consumers, but for insurance companies so that they know how much to charge you for your insurance bill. So this is a third party test and you know it's gonna be good because this is gonna be used by the insurance companies. You guys know that I love my EC6. I truly believe that Neo, in terms of car quality and safety, everything, I think it's better than a Tesla. If it wasn't, of course I'd buy a Tesla, right? So. I'll shut up and let's go watch the uh, crash test video. So inside this video, you can see that they did a 25% surface front collision. This is actually the most dangerous type of collision because when you have 25%, you don't have the, the center piece of uh, the front to protect you, right? So most of the time when you have a 25% collision, what would happen is the driver or the passenger would suffer injuries. So in this case, we saw that the structure of the car held up and what's really impressive was that the A pillar remained intact. So if the A pillar didn't remain intact, then that would mean the structural rigidity of the car isn't there to protect the passenger. On top of that, they also performed a side on collision to see if the airbags will do well. And of course, as expected, the airbags performed very, very well. Let's go to the results. So the results in detail. So here, here's how they rank it. We got G, A, M, M, P. G is great. A is awesome. M is so-so and P is poor. And we can see that Neo in the first section, which is ease of repair and cost of repair. So they put that as A. It means it's gonna be fairly easy to repair. The cost isn't too expensive. The next section that we're moving on to is the passenger safety. This got the maximum score possible, which is all G. First is, you know, front 25% collision. Of course, they did well. Side collision, they did well. They also performed a roof safety. So that also performed really, really well, and also how protective the seats are. Neo's ranked the highest in all these categories. The next area that they tested was the pedestrian safety. What's also really important for insurance companies is if you run into someone like a pedestrian, you also gotta pay for their medical bills and stuff like that. So that's also a topic that they have to cover. Pedestrian safety, it ranked highest. That means, you know, people outside are very unlikely to get injured. The next topic is driving safety assistance score so that would be like a automated braking when the car in front of you all of a sudden stops and the driver doesn't stop Nia also ranked really really good on that as well now where does this stack up against Tesla now if we compare the score to, to its competitors we see that you know of course Tesla is a super safe car no doubt about that for the passengers inside the vehicle now in terms of ease of repair and cost it's it ranks a bit lower than Neo's EC6, meaning it's harder to repair. It'll cost more to repair compared to Neo's EC6. What's really shocking was that as good as Tesla's autopilot is, and everyone's saying Tesla autopilot is the best in the world, Tesla actually performed worse in pedestrian safety. Now, why is that? I'm gonna share with you this little clip. Of course, we all know that if there's a pedestrian in front of the road and both Neo and Tesla, you know, were driving right towards that pedestrian, it's going to stop. But what often or not what happens is that pedestrian comes out of a blind spot in front of another bus or a car. So if that pedestrian all of a sudden pops out, what will happen? Well, the Neo was able to stop, but surprisingly, Tesla rammed right into that pedestrian. Man, I would not want to be that pedestrian. That would not be a good day. So there you have it, take it for what it's worth. You know, Neo is a good car. Everybody thought that Tesla had the best quality. Tesla had the best autopilot. It's good, all right? But, you know, you can start seeing roofs falling off of Teslas, the bumpers falling off of Teslas, and then you see this, where the autopilot, as good as, as it is, it still rams into that pedestrian. So, you know, something for you to take in. I hope you like this video. Subscribe, check out my other videos. Take care. Peace out.